what is the relationship between the objective or objectivity and being? Um, in regards to this question, I tend to think about the objective and the subjective as both being in relationship to one another and the entire assembly of objective, subjective, and their relationship as being. So in that sense, um, if the question is referring to the objective as the world or other people or something other than what I feel as to be my interior subjective self, um, or other than the process of the relationship between self and other or self and reality, um, then to some extent, uh, you know, this notion of being kind of has an inclusiveness that binds all of these um, aspects together. Uh, if, on the other hand, the question was thinking about the notion of objectivity rather than the objective, so in other words, a quality rather than a thing, um, then the, the, the answer is a little different because uh, now we're looking at a somewhat different triple, the triple of um, existence, um, objectivity, and being, or what I call real. So in this sense, the notion of to be real and to, ex to exist and to be objective are treated distinctly. And I think I've commented on that previously, so uh, I don't need to do that now. But in this sense, um, there are two ways to interpret the question, one of which is to consider the objective in the triple of uh, subjective, objective, and their relationship. And the other is to consider the notion of objective in the sense of um, uh, being or reality, uh, existence or existentialism, and uh, objectivity in the sense that it's used in, uh, say, the scientific method. Um, and, and in any of these cases, um, there are, again, some subtle differences in terms of how, those, uh, how the terms are defined. Um, but I believe I've covered this elsewhere, so I'm not going to uh, belabor this further now. <laughs>